Hello, I had some requests for a hair tutorial on how I did my hair in my last couple of videos, which was like half a freaking century ago, but anyway, it was basically just voluminous with just a little bit of curl at the bottom. Um, I'm going to be using, well, before I blow dried my hair, I used Herbal Essences Totally Twisted Curl Boosting Mousse, which really does help my hair stay um, maintain its shape when I curl it. The only problem is when I'm styling it, I'm sure you can see when I'm styling it, it seems like my hair is kind of stuck together. Um, but other than that, I really like how well it helps my curl hold. I'm going to use Herbal Essences Body Envy Volumizing Hairspray. And Hot Rollers. These are from Conair. I got them at Target. They're like $20, $25, something like that. Very inexpensive. Um, the largest ones, I think, are probably about one and three quarter inches. The smaller ones are an inch and a half. And then for teasing, I'm going to use just a little bristle brush. I prefer using a bristle brush over a comb because um, it seems like whenever I use a comb, it takes way too long to untangle. It's much better with a brush, for me at least. Anyway, um, here's the tutorial. I'm going to be using the four largest rollers for the uppermost sections of my hair. Since the goal is more about having volume rather than a lot of curl, um, I'm going to do a section in the crown, a section on each side of my part, and my bangs. Well, they're overgrown bangs, but what used to be my bangs. Um, I'm going to start with the crown. I'm not really picky about the size of the sections since I'm really only trying to curl the ends. I'm going to spray some volumizing hairspray on the root area and just on the ends. And I'm going to go ahead and tease it a little bit. And when I roll my hair in the roller, I'm going to pull my hair towards the opposite direction so that when it's rolled up, the root area is lifted a little bit. And just clip that. Now I'm going to do the same thing for the top section on each side of my part. Spray just the root area and the ends. Pull the section in the opposite direction. And I'll do the exact same thing on this side. For the bangs, I'm going to lift them straight up and roll back 
toward away from my face. And for the rest of my hair, I'm just going to roll them in no particular direction or anything, just randomly throughout the, the length of my hair. I'm only going to spray the ends. And it's not necessary to roll all the way up. I'm just going to go about a little more than halfway. And then I'm just going to wait until the rollers are completely cooled down before I start styling it. Don't take them out, even if they're just if they're still just barely warm, because it can cause your hair to fall flat a lot sooner. It's been about 15 minutes now, and they're completely cooled down, so I'm going to take them out. I'm just gonna shake the curls out with my fingers to break it up a little bit. Just keep adjusting and finger combing, scrunching, whatever you have to do until everything is in place. You can go ahead and tease more if you need more volume, but as you can see, mine's already pretty big from the bit of teasing I did as I was curling it. And then just set with a little bit of hairspray. And that is it. There you go. It's still not completely in place, but I'm far away from my mirror, so I'll have to get a little closer to finish, to kind of get it just how I want it. Just a little bit more adjusting. The curl will fall a little bit more throughout the day, so really it'll just be curled at the very ends. And, and that's it for now.